everybody. This is Pragati with Cyber Group, bringing you another tidbit session on visual flows. In the previous episode, we saw the basics of flow and how to create an object record using a flow. In this episode, we're going to see how to launch a flow from a record page using a button in Lightning Experience. If you would like to learn more about flows, please refer to trailhead.salesforce.com and search for flows. Let us now see how to create a button and embed the flow URL in the button. What is a button on a record page? Buttons are used to define actions. All standard and custom buttons will appear here on a page layout based on how the user has defined the order in the page layout. How to fetch the flow URL? To get started, we need a flow. In my last tutorial, I created a flow called Create Bid a Record, a very simple flow that creates a bid record. Let us now go fetch this flow's URL. When you go to your setup, Flows, what you see here are the list of flows available in your org. Let me now go to this particular flow and say View Details and Versions. What I have here are all of the flow versions available and what I am interested in fetching is this particular URL. Let me go ahead and copy this URL. Remember, no matter how many versions of flow you have available here, only one particular version can be made active at a particular point of time. Let us now go ahead and create a button on an opportunity to create a bid record. Let us now go to the opportunity object. Let's go to the buttons, links and actions. Let me click on new button or link. What you see here, I'm going to go ahead, give this a name. You can give a description of your choice. Display type. The first type is called as a detail page link. This particular option displays on a details page as a link, which takes you to the URL that you have defined in this particular box. What you see on the second option is a detail page button. A detail page button is what we intend to build right now. These are called as the detail page buttons. And the last option is called as a list button. To add list buttons to related list, you have to edit the related list properties on the page layout where the opportunity related list appears. I shall give you an example. Opportunity and account share a lookup relationship. If you go to the accounts layout, when you go to its related list and opportunity, when you click on this particular icon, when you go to buttons, you see the option to include this new list button that I created here. So you typically can add list buttons to related list on the page layout where the opportunity related list appears. Let us now go back here. Let me now go ahead and place the flow URL right here. I have chosen detail page button and I'm going to save this. Now we have to edit the opportunity page layout to display this button. Let me go to the page layout. Let me go to the opportunity layout. Let me now go to mobile and lightning actions. And let me now go ahead and add this button that we created. Let me hit save. Let us now see how to invoke this flow from the newly created button. So this particular opportunity called 1000 kilowatt generator is what I'm going to be using to invoke the flow from this button called new bit. Let me now click on the new bid. Let me now give this particular bid a name and an address. Let me just say next. So it has successfully created a bid record. When you go to the bids object and you refresh, what you see here will be the newly created bid record. An important point to note is when I click finish on the flow, 
it does not take us back to the record which invoked this flow or on which the button was present. I would definitely love to improve the user experience by redirecting user to the record page which launched the flow after flow completion. Let us now go ahead and quickly make a small change to the button to make this feature available. You have to go in here, type question mark, return URL, and you have to give the opportunity ID here. Okay, let me now go ahead and hit save. You're typically telling the button the return URL is the opportunity which invoked or which uh, invoked this particular flow. Let me go, go back in here. Let me go back to my opportunities. Let me again use the 1000 kilowatt generator. Let's say new bid right now. Let us go ahead and create a new bid. Let us say next. Now when I click finish, this will now take us back to 1000 kilowatt generator opportunity which invoked the flow. This concludes this episode and I want to thank all of you for joining me. If you have any questions or comments, please comment below and do not forget to subscribe to our channel for future Visual Flow tutorials.